What's up guys, it's Sydney and today is your 34 minute HIIT workout with dumbbells. So grab your dumbbells and let's go. What's up guys, so we've got 34 minutes of work today. Hope you've got your dumbbells ready, I've got mine ready. We're gonna start with circuit style training today. So high intensity, we've got three exercises per circuit, three rounds through each circuit, 30 seconds work, 15 seconds rest. All right, I'll show you the first move and then we'll get started. We've got front raise and side raise. So one arm's going to the front, one to the side, and then we're gonna switch. All right, three, two, one, let's go. 30 seconds of work here, one to the front, one to the side. Try not to relax your arms at the bottom. Okay, so when I come down to my legs, I'm not slamming. I'm just stopping here, switching directions, taking that arm to the front now or to the side now. Okay, 30 seconds there. We've got 10 more seconds left. And then I'll tell you about your next exercise. Good job, four, three, two, one. You can rest. Your next exercise, we've got a lateral lunge to the right, to the left and a sumo squat jump, okay? Left, right, sumo. We're gonna go in five seconds. Let's take it to the left first. Dumbbells in front, two, one, let's go. Left side, right side, and squat jump. Back to the middle. Left lunge, right lunge, and squat jump. Great job. So each circuit is gonna have an arm exercise, a leg exercise, and a core exercise. 10 seconds, so that means we're moving on to the core next. In five seconds, you're gonna drop down into a plank position and I'll show you what to do from there. And rest, good. Take your dumbbells, put them shorter width apart onto the top of your mat. We're gonna be walking over and back. Okay, so both hands in, both hands out. Okay, here we go. Let's start in the middle, go to the left. Ready, and go. There you go, walk it out. Make sure your hips are not swiveling. Okay, no rocking around, just keep everything nice and tight. Pulled in, belly button's pulled to your spine. Great job. 10 seconds, and then we'll go back up to the top for your front raise and side raise. Three, two, one, all right. 15 seconds rest. And we're back up for round two. Front raise, side raise. Big deep breath. All right, here we go in five seconds. Slight bend in the knee. Two, one, let's do it. Nice job. I'll give you a slight bend in the knee to make sure that when you come up right, your lower back doesn't arch. Okay, so if you get a little bend here, just a little better likelihood that your lower back stays where it needs to be. Good job. 10 seconds. That's it, that's it. Five, four, three, two, and rest. Good job, so we're back to the lunges. Left lunge, right lunge, sumo squat jump, okay? Going to the left first for the middle part of round two. Three, two, dumbbells in front, let's go. Left side, set those hips way back on the lunge. And sumo squat jump. Good job. Sumo. Almost there. 15 seconds. Whoops. Sumo. Good job. To the right. Back to the middle. You've got eight more seconds. Sit back. Sit back. Sit deep. And jump. Two, one. Rest. Good job. Dumbbells are back down on the mat for your plank walkover. They're just about shorter width apart, just enough room so you can fit both your hands inside. We're going back to the plank. In three, two, one, let's go. Walk it all the way over, both hands go outside the dumbbell, inside, outside. If you need a modification, drop to your knees, but make sure that your hips aren't staying up. Okay, they stay nice and low. Okay, if you can, stay up on your toes. Another modification, just stay up in this high plank. Okay, if you can't walk over and back yet, just develop your strength by staying in that plank. Two, one, and rest. 
All right. So last round here, last round of these three exercises. You guys are doing great. All right, here we go. Five seconds, front raise, side raise, in two, one, let's go. Raise it, raise it. Try to work on not touching your legs when you get down. Notice how I'm just swinging over. Switch directions to the other way. Slight bend in the knee. Almost there. Last 10 seconds. Feel that shoulder burn. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. Great job. All right, so we're back to lateral lunge, lateral lunge, sumo squat. Modification for that one, just take the sumo squat, jump out, just do a sumo squat, okay? Here we go, five seconds, dumbbells out front. Two, one, let's go. Sideways, sideways, stop here, down, and jump. Make sure that jump for your sumo squat is nice and soft in the landing. Okay, you don't wanna land with your legs straight. Good job, guys. Lunge, lunge, and jump it up. We've got five seconds. Let's get through one more round here. Jump it up, two, one. Great job. Let's go down to the mat. Last round of plank walkovers. All right, if you need to, just stay up in this high plank. If you can, walk it out with me. Three, two, one. All right, let's go. Over and back. Pay attention to your hips. Like I said, if they're opening and closing with every step, you're not doing it right. Slow it down. Keep your hips facing the floor. Great job, 10 seconds. That's it. Three, two, one, and rest. You've got 15 seconds to rest. Our next move. It's gonna be a bent row, forward raise. Bending forward at the hips, okay? Arms are starting straight down. Squeeze the shoulder blades, relax. Front raise, relax. Ready, let's go. 30 seconds here. You're gonna feel it in your shoulder blades for the row, so all up your back. When you do the front raise, we're back to the shoulders again. Great job, 10 seconds. That's it, that's it. Good work, three, two, one, and rest. Next one, 15 seconds rest, watch me. You're gonna go single leg RDL, knee drive, and switch. So RDL, knee drive, and then switch. All right, here we go, three, two, one, let's go. RDL, drive it, switch legs. Good, reach, reach, reach. Squeeze the glutes forward. Reach and squeeze. This one's all about the hips going back and forth. Okay, so the leg that goes back, driving it forward. Whoop. Dig that heel down. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. All right, lay it down. No dumbbells for this one. Okay, we're gonna go hip raise, toe touch. Okay, hip raise, toe touch. In three, two, one, let's go. If you want to, you can use your dumbbells. We got them, so why not, right? Hip raise, toe touch. Great job. 15 seconds. Slow this one down, make sure you're not just rolling back and forth. Hip raise, relax. Toe touch, relax. Great job. After this one, you're going back up to your bent row. And rest. All right, back up to the bent row and the forward raise. Okay, keeping the same bent over position. In four, three, two, one, let's go. Row and raise. When you row, your palms are facing your chest. When you raise, they're facing the floor. Great job, squeeze each group of muscles. So in the row, squeeze back, 
On the raise, squeeze your shoulders. Feel them. Ignite. Mind on fire. Woo. Five seconds. That's it. Three, two, one more row, and rest. Woo. Good job. Back to your Romanian deadlift to knee drive. If you want to step this one up a little bit this time, go deadlift with a hop in your knee drive. Okay? Three, two, one. Let's do it. Deadlift, drive the knee, a little hop. Focus on a spot on the floor when you go down for that deadlift. Here, drive, find it, focus, and squeeze the glutes. Great job. Whoop. Almost there. 10 seconds left. Good, keep working, keep working. Got time for one more. Two, one, and rest. Have a seat. Get back to the leg raise. And toe touch. Okay, lay it back, feet are up in the air. Raise the hips first, crunching up with your toes second. Two, one, let's go. Hip raise, toe touch. The hip raise is good for your lower abs. Toe touch is good for the upper abs. So all of it's part of the rectus abdominis. Okay, your long six pack muscle in the middle of your chest. 10 seconds, you're doing great. Nice job, three, two, one, and rest. All right, back up top, bent row, front raise. Last round through, all right? Round three, here we go. Four, three, two, one, and let's do it. Squeeze and raise, squeeze, Raise it out. Good job. Nice work. That's it. Squeeze your shoulder blades back. Make sure your core is tight so your back isn't arching. Got about 10 seconds left on this one. And then we're going back to the Romanian deadlift. Knee drive. Whew. Almost there. Five. And rest. Good job. Romanian deadlift with a knee drive hop at the top. We're back there for the last round of these guys. Four, three, two, here we go. Deadlift and drive, switch legs. Deadlift on the deadlift. A couple things to make sure of. Your back is nice and flat. Shoulder blades are engaged. You're putting those dumbbells right beside your straight leg. Okay, so make sure you're not reaching for the ground with your dumbbells, okay? 10 seconds. Two, one, and rest. You're back on the ground. Toe touches and hip raises. Last one in the second circuit, guys. You're doing great. Here we go. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. And toe touch. Job. Raise it up, reach. Raise it up and reach. We got 15 seconds. Almost there. Reach, reach, reach. Nice and high. Five seconds. A little higher. Get those feet up just a little more. And rest. All right, stay down here on your mat. If you need to grab a quick swig of water, you can do that. Your next one is a chest fly with an overhead raise. Or with a straight arm pullover, I should say. All right, here we go. Lay it down with me. Chest fly. Link the dumbbells together. Pull it over. Open. Reach. Open. And reach. Good job. 30 seconds right here. Make sure on the chest fly, your arms are nice and rounded. Almost there, three, two, one, and rest. All right, place one dumbbell down at this end of the mat, one dumbbell down at the other end. So you're gonna jump down to the dumbbell, pick it up, squat jump, turn around, switch directions, do the same thing, okay? Two, one, let's do it. 
Jump forward, grab it, squat jump, and turn back around. Same thing, squat jump, grab that dumbbell. Make sure you're landing nice and soft. 15 seconds left. Good job, hit down to the other end, grab it, up. Come on, five seconds left here. Up, let's get one more in, three, two, one, and rest. Whew, great job. Both dumbbells up to the top of your mat here. We're gonna go plank, dumbbell, pike. So take one dumbbell, place it back at your toes, and the other one, and then we're gonna grab and bring it back up. Ready? Let's go. Grab it, bring it back up, and then we're gonna place them right back. Try to cross your body, so right leg, left arm, left arm, right leg. Just a little bit more core rotation will work for you. All the way down, reach, all the way down, and grab. Great job. Five seconds. Whew. And rest. All right, great job. Lay it back down onto your back. We're back to your chest fly and straight arm pullover. Nice rounded arms here. Big open, big squeeze back together. Five seconds, four, three, let's go. Open, reach, and pull. So that straight arm pullover, you wanna feel your lats engaged. So right below your armpits, in the back lower part of your upper back, if that makes sense. <laughs> we wanna feel those guys engaged, stretched, and then pull back over. Five seconds and you're going back to your squat jumps. Two, one, all right, raise it up. One dumbbell at each end of your mat. Move my water out of the way here. Going back for squat jumps. Grab the dumbbell, pick it up. Switch, turn around, same thing back. Two, one, let's go. And up, turn it around, jump down, and up. Nice soft landing here. Go, switch it on around. Round two, you guys should have the hang of it by now. Good job, 10 seconds left. And back down, land, up. Good job. Here we go, three, two, one. Grab both your dumbbells. We're going back to the plank, hike. Okay, so remember, take both dumbbells back to your feet. Bring them both back up top, okay? Alternate sides. Three, two, one, let's go. High plank, grab it with the left, take it to the right toe. Grab it with the right, take it to the left toe. And reach, pull them right back up. We're gonna make sure in each round when you are stopping in the middle, that you're nice and flat in that high plank, and then you bring it back up, okay? Feel your lower belly engaged. Woo, you guys are doing great. Five seconds. Two, one, and rest. Last round of chest fly. Grab your dumbbells, lay it on down. Chest fly, straight arm pull over. Here we go. In four, three, two. Dumbbells over your chest. Let's open it up. Open and reach. Open and reach. Good job. I have my knees bent like this just because it's good to have your lower back nice and flat on the floor. Okay, if you have your legs straight out, it's easier for your back to arch, so I just like to keep mine bent. 10 seconds, open, big squeeze in the chest, reach, three, two, one more reach, and rest. One dumbbell at each end of the mat. Here we go, last round of squat jumps with a squat pickup. We're doing great, guys. Okay, here we go, in four, three, two, one, let's do it. Jump down, grab it, stand, switch directions. Jump, jump, and switch. Modification here, step down, squat, pick it up, turn around, same thing, back. Just step down and pick it up if you're not ready for that jump yet. If you are, come with me. Whew. Jump it up, got about five seconds left here. Let's get one more in, three, Two, one, 
All right, great job. Last one of this third circuit. Going back to the plank pikes, guys. Here we go. Whew. Three, two, high plank. Let's go, left arm to right foot. Right arm to left foot. Back to the top. Grab it and grab it. That's it. Great job, you're doing good. Back to the high plank. Back to the high plank. Almost there. Whew. Got about 10 seconds. Grab it, flatten out. It's good for the shoulders too, right? Three, two, one. All right, rest, you're gonna lay it back down onto your back. This next one, we're gonna start with six inch raises with legs to dumbbells. Okay, so starting up here, you're gonna raise one leg down, drop one leg down, I should say. Ready, let's go. Drop one, bring it back up. So a little something I didn't tell you yet. <laughs> this fourth circuit is all core, all abs. Good job. 15 seconds. So we got ab, ab, ab. Your last circuit, cardio, cardio, cardio. Okay, so we got the total body strength in. Now we're toning up the abs. Then we're gonna tone up with some cardio. Two, one, rest. You're gonna drop one dumbbell down. Keep one in your hand. Take your legs to a tabletop position. Reach overhead and swoop your dumbbell under your legs. You're gonna switch hands and the same thing back under. Okay, two, one, let's do it. Tabletop legs, they stay right there. Good, touch at the top and switch under the legs. Touch and switch, touch and switch. So you're sitting all the way up here. Touch and switch, 10 seconds. Good job guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Next one, grab both of your dumbbells. You're laying it back on your back again. This one I call it dead bug. So arms and legs are coordinating. Okay, you're gonna take a straight leg, take that arm, lower it down back to the top and keep going. Okay, kind of like a reverse mountain climber. Two, one, let's do it. Whew, nice and slow here. So the arm and the knee are connected. Just think of your dumbbell always staying about six inches from your knee on that same side. Whew. The goal here, keep your lower back flat. If you need to channel your legs up a little higher, that's okay. Just keep your legs and arms coordinated and your back flat. Five seconds, reach a little farther if you can. Two, one, rest. All right, so we're back to the top. Six inch leg lowers. You're lowering that top leg all the way down to six inches off the ground, bringing it back up. The dumbbells over your chest just kind of keep your back a little bit flatter. Two, one, let's go. Keep your dumbbells right where they are. Stop at the top and switch. Again, draw your belly button down into the mat. If you want a little extra challenge, you can open your dumbbells up a little bit more over top of your head. If you need a modification, take that leg that you're dropping and do a bent leg drop. Okay, seven seconds. I'm gonna open mine up just a little more. Three, two, one. Great job. Sit up and drop one of your dumbbells down. We're going with that tabletop leg. Switch under. Okay, so you're gonna sit all the way up. Switch switch underneath your legs. You guys are doing great. Here we go, three, two, one, let's go. Switch under, touch at the top with your hands, take it back under, back to the other hand. This is a tough one. Keep your legs out past your hips, so I don't want your knees crunching up here, okay? Keep them away from your body. Touch, switch, touch, switch. Five seconds, three, two, one, and rest. Woo. <laughs> Grab both your dumbbells, we're back to the dead bug. Woo. Great job, guys. Remember, arms and legs coordinate, so the same side is moving at the same time. Two, one, let's go. Stretch it, stretch it. That's it, nice work. Arms and legs go together. So when your leg drops, your arm drops. When your leg comes back up, 
Arm comes back up. 15 seconds. Great job. Woo. Five seconds. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. Woo. All right, one more round of that. I'm gonna grab a quick swig of water. You can do the same if you need some. Whew. Here we go. Back to the six inch leg drop. Ready, let's go. Drop one leg, bring it back up. Last round of core, and then we're hitting some cardio. You know me, I love the agility work. So we're gonna switch it up. Switch directions for your body all the time. Keeping it quick, as no one likes boring cardio. Great job, great job. Five seconds. Whew. Three, two, one, rest. Drop one dumbbell down by your side. Taking that tabletop leg position. Up and switch. Tap over your head, bring it right back under. Four, three, two, one, switch it under. Here we go. Touch at the top and switch. So you're coming into a full sit up. I want your shoulder blades all the way up off the ground and then back down. Okay, so don't be trying to do just a crunch, switching your dumbbell, you're gonna hurt your neck. All the way up to a seated position, back down. Almost there, seven, six. Give me one more, three, two, one. All right, grab the other dumbbell. Last one of your core circuit, dead bug. And then we're back up on the mat for cardio. Whew. Big deep breath here. Raise those dumbbells up, two, one. Straighten your left, reach, reach. Almost there. Great job, great job. Last 15 seconds, and then you get a 15 second rest, and I'm gonna show you what we're doing for our cardio. Pull, 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 come on. Uh, three, two, one, and rest. Whew. Hop up off your mat, only 15 seconds. So dumbbells are about two feet apart on your mat, okay? We're gonna go single leg hop overs. This way down with your left leg, on the way back with your right leg. Let's go. 30 seconds, back, switch it over to the right. Back to the left, and switch quick. To the right, left, left, switch. Right, right, switch. Try to get a little hop in your turnaround too. Okay. Good job, we've got seven seconds. Left, left, switch. Right, right, and rest. Keep your dumbbells right where they are. We're gonna go lateral agility hops. So two feet in, two feet out. Okay, keeping that same movement. I want you to make sure your arms are working with your legs. Here we go, two, one, let's go. One, two, three, tap, one, two, three, tap. Okay, keep that going as quick as you can. 30 seconds here. Good job, we've got 15 to go. This last one, you're gonna grab your dumbbells off the ground. So. When you're done here, in five seconds, grab your dumbbells. And rest. All right, pick them up. We're gonna go press jacks. So you're doing a jumping jack with a press at the top and a press forward. Up, out, up, out. Big deep breath. Oh, we're almost there. Two, one, dumbbells at your shoulders. Let's go. Up, forward, up, forward. We want to make sure when you're going forward, you pop in and out quick. Okay, so don't leave those dumbbells hanging in the air. That's it. Keep it going. 15 seconds. You're right there, five, three, two, one. Great job. Your dumbbells are back wide. We're back to the single leg hopovers. Make sure I'm not losing my stuff here. <laughs> All right, here we go. Two, one, 
Let's go down with the left leg. Left, left. Turn and switch. Right, right. And switch. Left, left. Switch. Right, right. Switch. <laughs> right, right. Turn it around. Good job. 10 seconds. That's it. Three, two, one. Leave your dumbbells right where they are. We're going to go lateral hops. Two feet in, two feet out. Big deep breath. I know I'll give you short rest periods this workout. It's intentional, okay? I want you to keep your heart rate up. Short rest. Let's go. Tap, two, tap. One, two, three, tap. One, two, three, tap. Notice how my arms are not hanging here. Okay, they're not holding myself up. They're working with my legs, just like I'm running. 15 seconds, speed it up. Two, two, two. That's it, four, two, one, rest. Grab your dumbbells. We're back to the press jacks. Great job. Whew. Big deep breath. Three, Two, one, bring it to your shoulders. Here we go. Up, out, in and out. That's it. In and out, in and out. Make sure your core is tight when you punch forward. That's it. 10 seconds. I know my calves are burning. <laughs> I'm sure yours are too. Here we go. Three, two, rest. We've got one more round, guys. You can do this. Grab a quick swig of water. Eight seconds left. All right, throw it down. Here we go. Three, two, one leg hops. So let's go. And switch. Left, left, switch. Right, right, switch. Good job. Keep it up, 15 seconds. Whoops, messed that one up. That's okay. Keep working. Seven seconds. Keep going, keep going. Three, two, one. Rest. Good job. It's okay if you fumble around if you're getting these hops all mixed up. It's fine, just keep moving, okay? It's the whole goal of this workout. Move your body, get your heart rate up. Get your breathing to sound like this. That's what we want. Two, one, let's go. Lateral. I think these are my favorites of the whole day. I love some agility work. Whew. That's it, 15 seconds, come on. Tap, 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 tap. That's it, you've got dumbbells. You can work out anywhere. Let's go. Five seconds. If you've got a mat, you can work out anywhere. Two, one, rest. <laughs> Grab your dumbbells. We've got that last round of plank jacks. Whew. You're doing great, guys. <sighs> Here we go. In three, two, one, crank it out. Up and out. Up and out. <sighs> good work, good work. Keep it up. Punch, out, punch. Come on. Move it if you need to. You've got 45 seconds left in the whole day. 15 seconds of work. That's it, here we go. Eight, seven, punch, six, five, three, two, one, and rest. Great job today. We're gonna take it into a little stretch. Bring your arms up over your head, pull over to the side as you breathe or try to. And switch arms, you're going back over to the other side. Whew. Just know that today, the only thing that was important is that you went all out. It's okay if you messed up. If you kept going, that's what's crucial. Okay, grab onto your quad. Stretch it out for a quick second. Grab onto your other quad. Quick, oops, stretch. And you have made it. Thank you so much for staying with me today, guys. If you made it all the way through, awesome job. 
thanks for working out with me today and let me know what you thought of this workout. If you finished it, comment in the comments below. Say, I did it. Make sure you subscribe so you and I can do this again tomorrow. Thanks so much, guys. Have a great day.